In this Grasshopper tutorial for beginners, I want to show you how I use uh, the Kangaroo plugin to convert a curve for the boundary and a series of curves as an inner profile uh, to make this final mesh. As you can see here, if I change these curves, the mesh is going to update. And I, uh, if I rotate this curve around the x-axis, the mesh is going to update. Uh, so we're going to learn how to use the Kangaroo plugin. Uh, also for the boundary curve, uh, we can deform it. So you can see that this is a deformed curve. Uh, so we're going to talk about that too. Let's get started from scratch. And what I want to do is to define one curve as a boundary and other curves are going to affect the final mesh. So I'm going to go to the Pam's menu, pick up the curve uh, component and right click and set this to this curve. Uh, now I'm going to make a copy and right click here and set multiple curves. Going to select these curves as uh, the boundaries. Uh, if you look at this from top, you can see that this is cutting the boundary from outside. This is inside. So I think this is a good example if we want to see how we can make the final mesh. Uh, okay, uh, what we want to do is to project, uh, use the projection to project it on the XY plane for both of them. And this is going to help us to uh, work more easily. So what I want to do is to uh, find a mesh on the ground, which is based on the cutting of these uh, boundaries here. Uh, we can go to intersection, shape, and find uh, the region difference between the projected curve on the ground and from these boundaries. So I'm going to give it to the curve B. And as you can see here, this is going to give us something like this and then we can go to the surface and use uh, the boundary surface to convert that into a surface uh, before we we can use the kangaroo uh, plugin we have to convert that into a mesh so i'm going to uh, go to the mesh utility uh, sorry triangulation quadri mesh give it to here it's going to convert that into quadri mesh and also triangulation quadri mesh setting give it to the setting and we can increase or decrease the number of the quads. So for example, we can say from 200 to 2000. And that's going to give you more accuracy if you increase this. So that's going to give us a rough quad remesh for our start. And then we're going to use the Kangaroo engine to bring this up. Uh, we have to extract these points here on this circle, on this edge, so we can work on that. And also we have to extract the vertices on these edges. So that's also important. 